All right, I want to talk to you guys about prepping a mobile home to be moved. This home is going to be moved in the next couple of days. Now, being that I'm a mover, I can kind of give you guys some points on what to do, how to save some money, and um, things you can do to help you with your move. So, first things first, you can see that this porch, um, something's going to have to be done with this awning. So you see there's screws up here. You can't really see it, but these things are going to have to be unbolted so that nothing is attached to the home. So if you have a porch or anything, um, you're going to have to get that removed. Now, some movers will do it, but they may charge a little bit extra for it. You can see that it has a tongue, but it's not bolted. Um, the good thing that you, I mean, the thing that you need to worry about is if you have a a tongue I mean you should hope that you have a tongue under your home because if not um, they'll have to come and bring one they do movers do rent them but um, it'll have to be welded to the home if it's not the original hitch that goes to the home and that can get a little bit pricey when you're dealing with a welder so hopefully you'll have your hitch underneath the home that's a good thing the straps and everything the movers are gonna take care of that the anchors skirting some will do it some won't uh if you do it again it will save you some money some movers ask that you undo the skirting that's something that i would require again you see the boats up here with the the awning that's gonna have to be removed porch that's gonna have to be pushed to the side um another thing that you want to look for is do you have tires and axles on the home? That's another thing you need to worry about when prepping your home for a move. Do you have tires and axles for the home? A lot of times you can just pull the skirt back and then you can see under here. I think this one does. Um, also, any power connections going to the home that's gonna have to be cut. AC units gonna have to be disconnected. So this is all, again, some movers do them, but I just require people to have all these things removed and the home ready to go. Some movers only just wanna hook up to the home and pull away with it. But these are the things that's the cost associated with moving a home. Again, the skirting, moving the awnings. Now you see this thing has a window unit. You're gonna have to remove that because you can't, if you have anything hanging out the windows, the home can't travel down the road with, with those things sticking out the window. So, uh, let's look on the inside. You see here it has the fridge. Now, more than likely it could be hauled with the fridge because this home is solid and it's pretty much over the axles. But if you have water beds and stuff like that, you better let the water out because those things can cause damage and have a leak. Any gas lines, you need to disconnect those things. Um, but your basic appliances, just you gotta think of anything that's heavy and make sure that um, make sure that there isn't anything that can get damaged while the home is being moved. So any valuables, I'll remove those. Get that removed from the home. But uh, guys, that's all the cost that's associated with the home. Uh, hope this video helps you out. Hopefully some of these things you can take care of yourself. If not, just know that some movers will, will do those things for you, but they may charge a little bit extra. And some won't. Some only want the home to be ready to go and they just want to hook up to the home and pull it away. So hope this video helps. But this is the things you need to do to prep your home to get ready to move. Also, guys, if, if you're interested in, in purchasing mobile homes or investing in mobile homes, getting them as rentals or whatever you want to do with them, they make a great investment opportunity. And if you want to learn more about it, just look in the link below. I have a video, I have a ebook that I wrote on how to make big money with mobile homes. I um, also have a DVD showing you how to negotiate with sellers for mobile homes. Um, if that's something that you're interested in, uh, look in the 
description below and it's something that you can check out. Thanks.